Hello grade 9 students, good day to all. Today, we will discuss the lesson 3, Relation of Other Art Forms and History in the Classical Music. The History and Art Form During the Classical Period The most significant event in the West during the Classical Era were the French Revolution and the Napoleonic Wars, the American Declaration of Independence in 1776, and the American Revolution. A time when the archaeological findings resulted the society to looking at the ancient Greeks and Romans, for example, of order and ways of looking at life. The calm, beauty, and simplicity of this ancient art motivated the artists, architects, and musicians to move away from the excessively decorated standards of the Baroque period. In the 18th century, the philosophers and scientists attempted to break from the past and replace the darkness and ignorance of European thought with the light of the truth. In the literature, the spirit of democracy was ignited by the writings of thinkers such as Voltaire and Thomas Jefferson. In their writings, they recommended that with the help of science and democracy, people can choose their own fate. In terms of music, the musicians moved from the heavily decorated style of the Baroque period and accepted the clean, uncluttered style of the Greek and Romans. Instead of using many melodies at the same time like the Baroque period, the classical composers make a clearer music in which one melody sings out while the other parts provide a simple harmonic accompaniment. The classical period is called as the golden age of the music. In this period, the musical forms are the sonata, concerto, symphony, string, forte, and classical opera. Now, let us discuss the improvised musical instrument. The Musical Instruments in Classical Period The musical instruments during the classical period are basically divided into four. The string, percussion, woodwind, and brass instrument. Let us discuss first the woodwinds. This family of instruments is composed of tubes that have opening on one end and a mouthpiece at the other. The keys are rows of holes covered by metal cups. The sound change happens depending on the air leaving the instrument. The instruments under this in descending general tone order are flute, piccolo, oboe, clarinet, bassoon, and saxophone. Next, let us discuss the percussion instrument. This group of instruments produce sounds in three ways. First, hitting, shaking, or scraping. Percussion instruments can be tuned or untuned, which affects 
in generating notes. The tuned instruments produce definite or specific pitches, while the untuned instruments deliver indefinite sounds or pitch. The instruments that produce particular tune are marimba, timpani, xylophone, while indefinite pitch percussion instruments are bass drum, cymbals, and snare drum. Now, let's move to brass. It is composed of long tubes where widened towards the end to form a bell-like shape. The instruments produce sounds through blowing the mouthpiece, thereby causing air to vibrate against the inner border of the instrument. The valves are connected to the extended pipes and when increasing the length of the pipe, it results to a lower sound. In changing the tune, the player must change his lips opening on the mouthpiece to create variation. Now, let us move to brass instrument. It is composed of long tubes which widen towards the end to form a bell-like shape. The instruments produce sounds through blowing the mouthpiece, thereby causing air to vibrate against the inner border of the instrument. The valves are connected to the extended pipes and when increasing the length of the pipe, it results to a lower sound. In changing the tune, the player must change his lips opening on the mouthpiece to create variation. In this group of instruments are Trumpet, trombone, bass trombone, French horn, and tuba. Remember, the music during the classical period has lighter and clearer texture. It is mainly homophonic. The melody is simple and easy to remember. There is ample use of dynamics. The phrases are very regular and of the same length. The harmony and the texture in the classical music are homophonic in general. The dynamics, which pertain to the loudness and softness, were clearly shown through the extensive use of crescendo and diminuendo. There is also practice of Alberti bass. This means that there is a style of broken chord accompaniment. For your learning task, ask your subject teacher kung ano yung gagawin yung task and ask nyo siya kung paano nyo isasubmit. For my student, this is your learning task. Perform the activity below and let's have story singing. Create an original story and turn it into a song by adapting a tune or music of the classical era. You can create or improvise an instrumental or rhythmic accompaniment for your song. For improvised instrument, I will put the link on the description box para meron na kayong guide kung ano ba yung mga gamit sa bahay nyo na maaari nyong gawing improvised instrument. Video record your performance using a cell phone or any device that you have and send it to your teacher through Google Form. You may ask assistance from your guardian, parents, or even your teacher. Here are the criteria for rating. Choice of music, 30%. Originality, 30%. Voice quality, 40% to the total of 100%. Okay, before we end our discussion, 
What have you learned on this lesson? Type your answer in the comment box below. Hope you learned something today! Please subscribe, like, and share. Have a good day and God bless!